Welcome back, everybody, to the official second channel of Homa Games, Homa Games 2. Today, we got an incredibly awesome video for you guys. As we all know, the brand new Fort Nightmares event is live inside of Fortnite. And with that, we have a ton of free rewards and a ton of challenges to go along with it. So what we're going to be doing, all right, is I'm going to show you guys every single reward that we're going to get from this event. And I'll also show you guys every single challenge that goes along with the rewards because of that I'll be able to guarantee you that by the time you're done watching this video you will have all of the information that you need in order to get every possible free Fort nightmares reward on your account before we get into that though we are nearing 820,000 subscribers here on home of games 2 we're on the road to a million subscribers but before we hit a million we gotta hit 820k. Currently, we're a little under 1,400 subscribers off 820,000. So if you're new, feel free to hit the subscribe button and maybe you'll end up being the 820,000 subscriber. If you don't wanna go to school tomorrow, hit the like button on the video. It might not work, but it also might work. So better safe than sorry, hit the like button. We have a total of nine different Fort Nightmares challenges to go over and also a total of nine different Fort Nightmares rewards. Some of them I can guarantee you've never seen before. So let's not waste any more time. Let's get into a game and get into it. Bada bing, bada boom. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen, on the spawn island, ready to get into a game. All right, but we got so many rewards and so many challenges to talk about that if we wasted another second, well, that would be bad. Here we go, drop in at the ruins, man. Hopefully, there aren't as many people landing here today as there was yesterday when this just got added. Because it was hectic, man. It was pretty crazy. Anyway, the first reward we're gonna talk about, this one doesn't really come from the Fort Nightmares challenges. But it's called the Bobo Watchings Emote, alright? This one was a little weird because everyone was supposed to receive this emote upon logging in for their first time during the update. But for some reason, I didn't get the emote, dude. So if you could, let me know down below in the comment section, alright? The emote that's called Bobo's Watching. Did you get that emote for free yesterday or no? I'm super confused, man, because everyone was supposed to get it, but I didn't get it, and I want the emote, dog. I want it, and I need it, so I gotta figure out what the heck's going on and why I didn't get it. We got an enemy right here, bruh. What are you doing, mate? Your pickaxe in the port of fort That is literally gonna take forever, dog. Oh, no. Alright, I thought he was gonna RPG me, dude. But that's not the only free reward that got sent out to everyone, ladies and gentlemen. So if you did end up getting the Bobo's Watching emote, you probably got this next free reward that was supposed to be sent out to everyone as well. This one was a sick little Fort Nightmares loading screen. Oh, Midas, what the heck, bro? What are you doing, Midas? Goodbye, Mr. Midas, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my goodness. Boom. There we go. Nah, you can have that, mate. That is all you, dog. That is all you. I got myself a golden pump, and that is all I need. But let me know down below in the comment section about that loading screen. Did you end up getting that one? Did you end up getting either of the two free rewards? Because they were supposed to go to everyone, but I didn't get either. Oh, we got a ghost, bruh. Goodbye, Mr. Ghost. Thank you for playing, all right? But that's not it, ladies and gentlemen. There was another free reward that was sent out to everyone. And this one, I think everyone ended up receiving. This was a free 40,000 XP. I don't know why Epic Games decided to just send us 40,000 XP, but I can't lie. It was a lovely little surprise to get yesterday. But alrighty, that concludes our list of super duper free rewards where you literally don't have to do anything. The rest of the rewards we're gonna cover in this video, they're all free, but you're gonna need to complete a challenge in order to get them. So obviously we all know about the Fort Nightmare challenges, the three challenges we were able to complete yesterday where we, you had to become a shadow which is obviously very easy all you got to do is literally just die and then you'll become a shadow right so i don't think any of you guys really need me to explain how to complete that one you also had to travel 100 meters using a witch's broom if you haven't done yet you can see a little picture on your screen right now showing you where all of the witch's brooms locations are at you'll also be able to find all of the little halloween candies that you need to eat 25 of in order to get midas's shadow wrap 
those are all located at the exact same spot as the broom. So you can get both those challenges done basically within one minute of each other. But now we move on to the hidden rewards and the hidden challenges that we have not yet seen in the game. The first three challenges will unlock, and I believe tomorrow morning we'll get the next three challenges, and then the last three challenges we'll get in about five days from now. And each time we see a new set of challenges unlocked, we will get one brand new reward, right? So coming up tomorrow, we are gonna see three challenges unlocked, all right? The first challenge is gonna be to deal damage with a possessed vehicle. If you don't know what a possessed vehicle is, basically, it's when you got eliminated and you become a shadow when you're a shadow You're actually still able to drive the vehicles So all you got to do is once you're a shadow hop inside of a vehicle and run into an enemy that is still alive You'll obviously deal damage to them and complete the challenge Unfortunately completing that challenge isn't gonna give you any rewards and you're gonna need to complete two more challenges before you qualify for the next reward, which is one of the best ones. Hold up, man. We got some enemies shooting at us right here. He is behind the rock. Come here, mates. Boom, we got one. Oh, we got a ghost in here. No, come here, ghost. No. Oh, my goodness. I am terrible. Boom, there we go. Wait, is this a... Oh, this is a real enemy. Oh, my goodness. Deleted. Oh, what up? Goodbye, sir. Oh, another one right here. What the heck? Oh, we got him too. Another one right here. Oh, my goodness. Absolutely deleted. Oh, and this is the last one. Boom. The squad white. Oh, no, wait. That was a different squad. There's literally more of them, man. Holy cow. Come back here, mate. Thank you. This guy thinks it's sweet, man. He thinks it's sweet. But it is not sweet, my good sir. Thanks for playing. Epic attempt. Moving on to our very next challenge. You must detect players as a shadow, all right? And in order to do this, all you got to do is when you are a shadow, just hit the L1 button, all right? And that'll kind of send out a ping, almost like you shook an enemy down, and it'll reveal all the enemies that, don't, that are near you. It'll tell you where they're at. Ooh, Mr. Kit. What up, mate? My aim is terrible, but uh, you didn't even shoot at me. All right, good try. Then the last challenge that is going to become available for us to complete tomorrow, we must eliminate Shadow Midas. Now, this one is definitely going to be difficult because we all know how many people land here at the ruins and are trying to eliminate Midas to get his drum gun. So that one is going to be difficult and probably take a little bit to actually complete. But the good news is it's going to give us a pretty dirty reward. So hold up. Boom, let me eliminate him. Oh, we got another one right here. Oh my goodness, I am feasting. Upon eliminating Shadow Midas and completing that challenge, you are gonna get one of the best Fort Nightmares rewards of this year, and that is the brand new smash o lantern pickaxe. Hey, moving right on to the very, very next challenge. These are the final two challenges for Fort Nightmares, all right? And these are pretty cool. So the first one, you're gonna have to visit different witch stacks. If you don't know what the witch stacks are, they're the exact same thing in the same place where you find the witch brooms as well as the candy. Oh my ghost, dog. There are so many of them, mates. Leave me alone, please, sir. Goodbye. What about this guy? Oh, and we got him too. What about this one? Holy cow, homie games going crazy. Ooh, we got a brave soul right here, man. Mr. Kit, thanks for playing. Bro, we got 23 eliminations right now, bro. What the heck? Visiting the different witch stacks. Unfortunately, that one isn't gonna come with a reward. But the second challenge that will be unlocked on that day as well will give you a reward and many people believe that this one is the best one in the entire event for the final challenge you are going to need to consume some legendary loot as a shadow ladies and gentlemen so obviously when you're a shadow you just got to go up to a piece of legendary loot and consume it 
and you'll get a bunch of health for it because if you didn't know whenever you consume any loot as a shadow that's how you regenerate your health after you consume enough pieces of legendary loot you will earn yourself the absolutely gorgeous bobo back bling being the very final reward here in fort nightmare don't forget for all the latest updated information regarding everything fortnite and the fort nightmares challenges make sure you're following me over on twitter at home games yt anytime there's any news any updates big or small inside of fortnite I put out a tweet as soon as it breaks, letting you guys know any news or info the second that it happens. After all, keeping up to date with Fortnite is literally my job, alright? So if you want, if you're interested in Fortnite news and everything, the Homie Games Twitter is a great place to stay up to date. Oh, come here, mates. We are lighting him up. Oh, now we're getting attacked by zombies, bruh. Oh dear. Goodbye, sir. Alright. We got six more humans remaining, and then we have 13 zombies. Oh, well, now 12 zombies. Bruh, I swear, ever since the Fort Nightmares update, it feels like the games take forever, man. But hey, I actually like it, dude. Fortnite's a fun game. I want to play it. I don't want to... I don't want the games to be short. You know what I mean? But boom, there we go. We eliminated one. Or, er, well, I guess technically now we eliminated him. Oh, the whole squad's here, bruh. They are all here, mates. Boom. One down, one down. Come here, bud. Uh-oh. 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 Oh, Macy got him. GG's. Oh, ladies and gentlemen. The victory royale, absolutely beautiful. That game took 25 minutes, but it was well worth it because that was incredibly satisfying. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Every single Fort Nightmares challenges, you now know how to complete it, as well as you know what's gonna happen once you complete it. If you guys enjoyed watching this video, feel free to hit the thumbs up button. And if you're not yet subscribed, feel free to hit the subscribe button as well. Let me know which reward is your favorite down below in the comments. Thanks again for watching, everyone. Have a great day. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.